Okay, guys, this is a video on how to um get custom fonts on your computer. There's a lot of things you can do with it. Um, the fonts. If you want to build a background and cursor and stuff, it's another video. Um, and I'll show you how to do that in another video. So, how to get custom fonts? First, you go to your Start menu. So, if you can't see that, go whatever internet you have. Doesn't matter. I have Google Chrome. It's a new one. Um, and then in the address bar, type in D A F O N T and dot com, and you'll get something that looks like that. Now, you can do any font you want. There's a lot of fonts that people people have made up. So, say I wanted one that started with a G. I'll go to G, and here are a bunch bunch of fonts. Okay, so I don't like any there. I'll go to another. L. Don't like any of that. Okay, sorry guys. I'm just gonna go to C because I'm B. So click a letter up here. It'll have, just click the letter and you'll find them. So there's a lot of fonts. This will work for Windows or Mac. And it doesn't take up too much space. So, say I wanted Buzzsaw. You just go over there where it says download PC Mac OS. Click on that. And it should download. Now, once it's downloaded, you can minus out of that and see a little folder pop up. Now, open it. And it should be like this. You should, you want to say extract all files. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, well, this one isn't actually a good font because it makes it all messed up. But. I have another font here. One second, guys. I just put those in the recycling bin. Okay. Um, I store them in my documents. I just say awesome fonts or cool fonts. And I have blazed. So once you extract it, you should come up with something that looks like this. If it's what's called blazed. It'll look like that, and it'll say blazed. Now, what you want to do is go to Start Menu, go to My Computer, and then go to HP Pavilion C, something you don't usually go to. Now, go to Windows, on, in all caps, then scroll down, there should be a lot of folders that look like that if you're on Windows. And go to the folder called Fonts. Here it is. See? Fonts. Double click on that. This will come up. If you look, they'll be in order and see I already have blazed right there, if you can see. Now, all you have to do, now it's installed once you put it in that folder. So if I say Start, run, notepad, and I want to type something in. One second. Um, you'll say edit, format, font, and see, it'll be there. Also, a cool thing you can do once you download custom fonts is if you have, one second, AIM. Just go to Edit, Settings, and go to General I Am, and then go to, or, okay, General I Am, and all you have to do is go to here, say More Fonts, and if you look, in the B section, it, or whatever name, 
name yours start with? Um. Sorry guys. There, blaze. See? Now I just say okay. Apply. Save. Now if I wanted I am somebody. Um, once you open it up, that's in Blaze, and you could just send it. Uh, sorry. And I, um, just sent that I am to my, um, some, somebody, but if they would look at it, usually it would, um, be that font for some reason it's not um I don't know why but see how it will say it shows over here that font and most of the time it will show the font over there I don't know why it's not doing it but my sister's computer is kind of messed up anyways <laughs> so thanks for watching I hope this helped please make sure to leave comments if there's anything I forgot or if there's anything you want to know about your computer PSP or stuff you can make at home with household objects. Thanks again for watching and make sure to subscribe. Bye guys.